Okay, so <laughs> this is how I'm recording the uh, video. <laughs> oh, anyway. So, oh, that's my leg. Uh, uh, so, uh, yeah, I dropped the uh, pre med program. I sent in the application on uh, the 19th of July, so last week. And uh, they finally started processing it, so I dropped the program because I don't feel like doing it. Um, I don't want to do it. I realize that, uh, well, the reason I joined that program was, well, I started seeing YouTube videos. <laughs> Every time I see a YouTube video, I'm always saying, oh, I should do that. Um, but uh, then I thought to myself, hmm, do I really want to do this? And uh, I was thinking, oh, I was asking myself, why do I want to do this? And then it sort of figured that I just, uh, I was asking, why do I want to be a doctor? And then I said, oh, I want to be a doctor for status and prestige. Uh, those are the main two reasons, <laughs> status and prestige, uh, having an MD next to my name, so it's all about the status thing, and then maybe also having a, you know, a comfortable life with income or whatever, but the main thing was status and prestige, and then I realized, hmm, I don't know if I can actually do the work of doing the doctoring part. <laughs> It's one thing to imagine the status and prestige, but the actual day-to-day -day doctoring part where you have to deal with people and all of that stuff. I'm like, hmm, I don't think this is going to be something I'll be enjoying. <laughs> so, uh, so I, you know, I, I thought about this for a long time, you know, uh, like, um, Perhaps I should have thought about this before applying for the program, but after applying and getting accepted, that's when I started thinking about, hmm, do I really want to do this? And yeah, so after you know talking to people, like my counselor, you know, people, yeah, psychologist and coach, uh, I, and I'm also thinking a lot to myself and watching lots of YouTube videos and people doing, you know, med students and all of this. I finally realized, oh, I can't do this. And also like working in a, like a lab, you know, with uh, cells and uh, I don't think I can do the, all that stuff. It's just not, uh, I can't do that. So, you know, like in, in lab settings when you have to work with biological <laughs> things. <laughs> so yeah, I dropped it. I have, I was, I have, I have been uh, changing my preferences with the same application. So I've got like other offers. So I've got a um, an offer to study advanced science at UNSW starting on twelfth October. I also got an offer for computer science honors on uh, at UTS, which starts on first August. And then I got another, oh well, yeah, recently I got a Bachelor of Engineering Electrical, uh, uh, yeah, mainly, well, I wanted electrical. Uh, that starts on the 12th of October at UNSW. So I've got three other offers. Well, I guess I can keep on uh, using the same application. I can try and see if I can get other offers. But then, so I'm, I'm thinking of doing the, electrical engineering the one i started last year <laughs> and i quit earlier this year um but then again i'm thinking i don't know i mean i'm not sure if uh, i'm not sure about that because i've also been thinking why don't i just stick to the to the law thing and try and become a barrister because you know i've already got the degree i've already been admitted so you know why don't i just do that because th then I don't have to go to uni for years and you know I can just straight away jump into this so that's also like uh, been on my mind and 
Yes, I'm kind of dealing with all of these things. Who? Why am I forcing myself to do these things? Why am I forcing myself? I can. I, no one's. No one is telling me to do anything. No one is telling me to do anything. But I am forcing myself. I feel like I have to do something. It's kind of stressful. It's like. No, maybe I. I've been listening to this audio book. It's something about. Uh, let me see if I can 